chapter 18 is called Searching for Fish Legs. At that moment, Hiccup didn't know why, but Egengard's story came into his head. Fly east, Hiccup said to the evil reaches. We're looking for a rock shaped like a witch's finger. Oh dear. Uh, the deadly shadow threw east. Hiccup did not want to find a rock shaped like a witch's finger. I'm not surprised, but he had to look. Look, there they are. Oh my God. One of those treacherous sea mist was blowing in from the east, so the dragon had to swoop low over the red sands. For a long time he flew. Surely it was too long for anyone to yacht that far. Looking down over the deadly shadow's shining shoulder, Hiccup saw what he dreaded to see. A crooked, jagged rock shaped like a lake witch's finger pointing upwards to the sky. A little way away was the speck of a, of a yacht on the sand. Oh, look, I can just see it, actually. There it is, the witch's finger. Down, Shadow, down, cried Hiccup in terror. Down they flew, and as they flew closer, Hiccup could see with the plummeting of his stomach that the yacht was not upright. It had, it had turned over onto its side. Desperately, he looked at the horizon, to the left, to the right, um, his eyes already blinking with tears. No sign of an untidy, tidy, daddy, long legs, fish legs bigger anywhere. Of course there could not be, because suddenly the truth broke upon Hiccup, the truth that maybe he had known somewhere all along. The story that Egengard had told him two nights before, the story about the monster and the slave boy. That story was not a story. It was true. And the reason that Egengard would have known it to be true was that she was there. She was there. She was with Fishlegs when the monster, monster truck struck and when that dreadful creature pulled Fishlegs beneath the sand. It explained why she was so fearful, so scared of the monster, but not of anything else. Why she had told him the story as if she had to tell it get it off her chest. It explained everything. Chapter 19 was called The Monster and the Slave Boy, but we'll have